And now I need to start syncing things up. We can use the waveform to start syncing these. So at the beginning of every track, like right here, right here, right here, right here, you can see where people counted themselves in. So I see the little count in there. I can see the count in here. This is why adding that count in is super important because it lets us sync everything up. So let's go to the very beginning here. And I'm gonna pull all these tracks just a little bit to the right so I can kind of organize them one at a time. So I need to sync everything up with this one, two, three, four, one at a time. So let's start with this one first, which is the Uke Mary. All right, so I need to, the one, two, three, four is right here on her track, but I can't move it any further to the left. So what I need to do is uh, delete this first part. So I can either do that by dragging this to the left like that and shortening it that way, or I can drag the playhead where I want it, click a track and hit Command B, which is going to split it. Then I can delete what I don't need and I can sync this up. So let's see where Mary said one, two, three, four, and let's sync this up. Oh, one, two, three, four. All right, that wasn't correct, so. Count, one, two, three, four. All right, there we go. So she says one, two, three, four, right at the same time. Excellent. All right, let's go with the next one. And we're going to find where she says one, two, three, four by looking at the waveform. There it is. Delete what we don't need. Bring this to the front. Zoom in a little bit to make this a little easier to see. And one, two, three, four. So here's Brian. Uh, right now, these are trying to lock themselves in. You see this little yellow line show up? That is because they are snapping to the grid so that they snap to each other, uh, which is a nice feature if you're trying to sync things up. But if you're trying to do some more refined uh, movements, you don't want that. And that button is right here, snapping. So I can just click that. If it's gray, it's off. If it's purple, it's on. So if I turn off the snapping, it doesn't. it's not going to show that yellow line where everything's going to lock up. All right. All right, great. If you want to do these one at a time and not hear the things as they go. So for example, if I'm trying to sync up Brian and the guide track without hearing Mary, I can click on Mary's track and hit the V key and that will mute that track. So now I won't hear Mary. One, two, three, four. And then I can bring her back in by just hitting V again. If you want to nudge things left and right, you can hit the period or comma keys to move things just a little bit to the left and right. All right, so Brian's all nice and synced up. As you can see, this process is going to take a while, but let's uh, let's go through and find everyone's beginning and sync them all up. Later. As you're going through, if you want to rearrange things to put stuff together, uh, you can click things and drag them up and down. And as you're doing that, it's going to tell you if you move it to the left or right. If you see that little plus showing you how many seconds you move things to the left and right. So I'm going to put the melodies together. So here's Bronwyn singing the melody and here's Mary singing the melody. I'm going to want those together. Um, I'm looking at, say, the acoustic guitar and the ukulele. I'll probably want to put those together so that it's easier to see them later. So as I'm going through this, I'm also going to organize this in a way so that makes it nice and easy to see where things are so it's nice and easy to find them. All right, let's keep going. One hour later. If at any point you need to turn something up or down, there's a little gray bar, and we'll get into this more later, in the middle of the track, and you just click that up and down, and it tells you how many decibels you bring the volume up or down. You can bring it up to 12 decibels higher, or you can bring it all the way down to complete silence. <laughs> 